Hi friends, my name is Host Eric. I'm the host of Talking with Finnish People. And I'm making this video specifically for INTPs. I've known a lot of INTPs who've had tendencies towards depression, uh, nihilism, and a general sense of what's the point. And this kind of thing can be maximized during this quarantine. It's one of the impacts that the proponents of it don't think about. Like, you got people who are forced into isolation for long periods of time. It's going to negatively impact people. Uh, when people lose their livelihood, it's going to negatively impact people. Um, for INTPs, the thing is, what they really want in life is to feel like a, a well-used tool. Like, they feel as though they're not, they lack self-motivation, they have all this potential, but they need somebody to manage them, to get them to do the things, to manage the FE and the SE, and uh, which is to say, to manage the patting on the back, that ITPs need a lot of patting on the back, and to manage the um, prompting to do things, to take advantage of their often remarkable gifts. Here's the thing to remember, if you're a younger INTP, things change as you get older, and you gotta give your older self some credit. This is something that all people should remember. When you're young, you get caught up more so in the experience of the moment, and in the temporary realities that can be negative. Um, but long term, you grow from those things and you find that life opens up as you get a little older. Sometimes you gotta help it along. You gotta help it open up a bit. I'd say it helps to find some sort of community where at least you can feel like in touch base with people and uh, have them understand you. It's one of the things talking with fans people provides. Um, I think INTPs, ENTPs, other intuitives who feel sometimes at odds with the sensory world as it's structured. But this video is prompted especially by a communication between Rachel and somebody she knows from Tumblr, a young man named Kazim, Kazim, something like that. And somebody with whom she's spoken before and who's expressed, I guess, the intuitive's, the intuitive's frustration, namely that, uh, I guess a lack of purpose, a lack of clear purposed um, directionality that that would that would normally provide somebody a certain level of meaning that's not otherwise provided. Well, that directionality for the INTP is supposed to be provided by a group or system that values and takes advantage of the INTP's gifts. And unfortunately, the world isn't really structured like that. It's structured so that the organizational management of individuals like that is well it's, it's a function of corporate corporate realities and very very infrequently uh, is it a function for those realities that INTPs, ENTPs are particularly uh, inclined towards philosophizing logic, reason um, you know fancy talk basically fancy talk would seem to some to be of limited utility I would say it's not, you just gotta find the right operation that's looking to take advantage of those unique skills. And you gotta understand that that's your problem. Your problem is you need somebody to help you take advantage of your skills. And you need a community where you feel as though you can be heard and understood and taken seriously. Um, so, you know, if you're an INTP who's feeling nihilistic, like Rachel's friend, I'd recommend 
spending some time on our live streams, hanging out with the other people who chat there. That's uh, that's the most active kind of community that we got going on now. I usually live stream every day, a couple times a day. So, but additionally, I just say, remember and give credit to your older self. I assume that between now and later on, things are going to change. They will. And often things can change dramatically in a single day. You know, before I met Rachel and started talking with her, I was in this, like, bad sort of like, ah, I hate dating, it's awful, blah, 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 you know? Uh, then I met Rachel and it was all different. Everything's been different since. She's been kind of a defining element in my life going going forward from that moment. Things can change very quickly. So don't give up hope, INTPs. Don't don't fall into nihilism or despair or despondency or depression. Um, this community is there for you. Uh, not 24 hours a day because I don't live stream that often, but a lot. And... Uh, there's always the raw rooms as well. I don't know how many people are in there at the moment. There's been a bit of a a recent drama regarding those rooms where a lot of the people who were there have gone off just a different place now, which is fine. But keep the faith, INTPs, during the quarantine and after it. You don't overvalue... You, you're in, not incorrect when thinking... That your potentials, your potentiality is, ought to be valued more highly than they are. But you're also incorrect if you think they never will be. you got to give time, history, yourself, people a chance to grow. The end. Thanks for watching. Bye.